Good morning and happy gray day, everybody. Uh, it's time to do our dailies. Let's take a look at what we need to do today. We need to customize, purchase an item, spin the wheel of misfortune, of course we do. Play a game and feed today. Note on the quest log is that they did recently add negs to the quest log in case you missed it. This is another means to just kind of help stabilize the neg economy. We got blue in here, I think glass, pink, ornate purple, rejuvenating neg serum, um, I think, and uh, not sure if there's any more, but they're all listed on the Jelly Neo. Pa oh, pink, pink and partitioned were the other two. So this is a means to just kind of help stabilize the neg prices because we had been seeing that crazy inflation going on, and no one's exactly sure why. We had some guesses, but no, no confident guesses there. So just a note on that. And let's see, for Gray Day, we do have an avatar opportunity, but I do have this avatar already. What you need to do is go visit the weather page, and on any of these rainy day rainy pages since every weather page should be rainy today if we click around yes everywhere is rainy today so this is also a great day to get the drenched as a battle dome challenger if you refresh on morocco's weather page you will get the drenched as a battle dome challenger these are both things that i have already so i can't show you the confirmation but make sure to do that today even though i don't think we'll have any news for gray day today unfortunately since it is sunday but uh, let's hop into our daily starting with our free food do you still need to catch up on a lot Lot of comments i know a lot of you <laughs> are commiserating with my pain on that ugga drop video but I'm glad to get the gold on that one it was it was painful it was so painful but yeah so sorry i've had a busy weekend so i gotta got some catching up to do today but as always gotta start the day off with your dailies well, let's go say hi to king altador good morning king thank you for the plushie and shop of offer Ooh, 100 spots a day from mr slork thank you mr slork and on to trudy's well, let's see what we get today Oh, got 14k because the bad luck bonus. Okay, I'll take that. And on to apple bobbing. Bob for apples. Uh, I'm... Oh, whoops. I must have double clicked. Okay, whoops. <laughs> that happens sometimes. And fire. Four forgotten shore map piece. Okay. And on to the neg cave. I'm gonna... Am I gonna look dumb today? Yes. Oh, we got this red. Okay, so these two click up like this. So I think, okay, I think this piece goes over here. This piece goes down here. So let's do that first. Okay, and then we need to lay this piece in, which goes up here. So I got a blue flower and a yellow square. Then our last missing piece is a yellow flower. There we go, we got angry emoticon hearts. Okay, and grave danger. We got a deadly attack spork from Delic. All right, thanks buddy, get back out there. We'll see you in five hours. All right. And let's go check in with Kiko Pop. I got that browser script running to help me play this one. Ooh, will we get a prize today? Ooh, we got snowfall in the night background. That's kind of pretty. Thanks. Let's check in. On, oh. <laughs> let's check in on the prize. Oh, that's right. We can't even do anything on the Kiko Lake page because that page is broken AF. Uh, 4K for that background. Okay, a little bit of value. Awesome. And time for the wheels. Starting with Wheel of Mediocrity. Let's see what I get today. And 500 today. Awesome. Thank you. And spin that wheel of excitement. Ooh, broke, broke even today. Okay, awesome. I'll take that. Okay, Wheel of Misfortune because we have to. Let's see. And we're gonna get a little prezzy, okay? Got a Von Cougar plushie. All right, thanks for that. And lastly, Wheel of Knowledge. Let's see, is today gonna be the Avatar day, huh? Huh? And we got a shield, wood blocking shield. Okay, thanks for the trash. Moving on to Tumbala. Let's play Tumbala for, ooh, we won. Finger crisp and some, oh, apple cakes, pancakes, something like that. Okay. And let's go check in with training. I was bad yesterday and did not finish my cycle. This is going to mess up everything for the week because <laughs> it's 8.30 my time right now and I usually record at like 7.30 during the week. So we're going to have a rough go with the Mr. Allen for a while. <sighs> Man, what do we need? Bree Lu Mao, Lu Orn Har Har EO. Let me see what I got. All right, and thanks to all my Code Sound sponsors. Couldn't be doing this without you. And uh, see you in 24 hours. Oof. And let's go check in with Snowager. Give me something. Okay. 
Okay, I got something. <laughs> I'll take your, your trash. Okay, let's go check in with the marrow. He's still sleeping. Time for the kings. Impress. I knew that already. Of course you did. And grumpy old king time. Let's change up this word to battle cards. I'm laughing my joke. No effect. Let's try again right now with a refresh and no effect again. Ouch. Time for deserted tomb where we open the door. Continue on. Oh, fiddlesticks. Okay, add that to the fiddlesticks pile and time for a fruit machine. I did actually win something yesterday. Got a Umagene win with 5,000 Neo points and a Cobra, so that was pretty nice. Finally had a little bit of fruit machine luck. And we got nothing today. Okay, fine. Let's go say hi to Coltson. Good morning, Coltson. And we're all healed to full health. Awesome. Needed that one. Needed that one. And time for Crave the Door Meteor. We take a chance to poke it with a stick for nothing. Okay. And magic with Grundo. Whatever. You're just a requirement that I don't even need need anymore. We got a discarded fire minky plushie though instead of discarded cloud croc, I guess. And time for fishing. Let's get everybody fish. Starting off with a land fish. Awesome. Those have generally been inflated lately. And reel in your line for a noopy nuppy and a skill increase. And reel in your line for a Darrigan seaweed. Okay. And reel in your line for scroll of the sea and a skill increase. All right. And reel in your line for another land fish. Awesome. And lastly, reel in your line for a bubble moat and a skill increase to 120. Awesome. Good job, Night Shivers. Back on the pets tab, I'm going to make Ada Win active so I don't forget. Going to give him a little groomy groom. I don't even think we need a groom today. Isn't it feed and, and customize something like that? So let's feed Ron Carrots. Uh bite of this jelly. And we'll do a background swap TM on Ada Win real quick like. Oh, let's go back to Tyrania today. Wonderful. And from here, we're going to knock out a game real quick. Stowaway Stain. Oh, I don't like this one. <laughs> it does still work and, and with the ruffle integration. So check that one out. It's kind of a puzzle-ish action game-ish thing. But bad favor for me right now. All right. And time for Kazlan Expella Box. Boop, 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 boop. We got nothing. Okay. And time for Lunar Puzzle. Still feeling lazy Lunar Puzzle. So I'm just going to randomly pick here. And we got some soothing stones because we lost. Okay, still handy for the coincidence, so suck it. <laughs> and forgotten shore. Ooh, we got some money today. Nice. Got 2,000. Awesome. I'll take it. Let's go check in with Food Club. And moment of truth. Ooh, okay. Ooh, 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 ooh. That was a nice win yesterday. Just stuck with a 10K bet yesterday, but got a payout of 510K in profit. Fuck yes. Oh, I guess technically it would be 420K profit if I took all my bets that I made. So awesome. Let's slap that money right back in food club. Okay. I am going to call something. Out. I usually don't show this part of doing food club bets, but I'm going to call something out. So I did my 14 K bet per usual. And when I hit the set bets amount to max, some of these are giving me lower than the value I input here. And that is because due to the odds, it'll cap out how much you can get paid out. So if we look at here, the bet that was placed for 13, a nine, it does cap us out at looks like a million in payout. So I just hadn't seen that out in the wild before. Um, so I guess the this is a very aggressive, adventurous day for an Ensheng set. So I think that's why some of these odds are looking crazy AF because we got a total potential payout of 7.1 million today. So high risk, high reward day. We'll see if any of this pans out, but these are some some tasty odds happening today. But just wanted to call out that um, if you are have an older account like I do, you might see this if you're using the, the Neo Food Club method to, to place your bets. So just uh, something I hadn't seen before wanted to share. Okay, but from here with our food club bets placed, let's go check in with the stock market. I am positive 6% overall. Might be time to sell something. Let's see. Got ACFI is in the 40s. Fair is at 56. Might be a good time to sell fair. I gotta watch that today. PDSS is in the 30s. Power is in the 20s. Skibbity is in the 23s. Got some stuff in the 20s. So, all right. So fair is the one to watch. Getting close to that 60 sell point for me. Only have 3,000 shares of this guy, but still make a nice tasty little profit for that. Awesome. Um, do I want to buy anything? That's the question. <laughs> Could get NAKR at 15 right now. Mm, let's put a little more money in NAKR. Why not? Great. And stock acquired. Moving on to Healing Springs. Heal me, please. 
Got 15 hit points, thank you. And don't forget, or don't forget me, <laughs> and a potion for the potion horde. Wonderful, I think with that, we should be able to clean out our quest log. Yes, so for customizing, we got 4,500 Neo points. For purchasing one item, we got 7,000 Neo points. For spinning the wheel of misfortune, we got a Snow Wars background. For playing a game, we got 1,500 Neo points. And lastly, for feeding, we got 5,000 Neo points. Awesome, making money today. Don't forget to claim that 20K to keep your streak progress going and we are one day away from this game controller collectible charm let's check in with price because I like to hurt my own feelings I bet this one's just still going down for some reason oh it came back up a little bit right I think so but okay still hovering around that same price point nothing crazy to report so let's move on to buried treasure still on the avatar hunt for this one let's pick here one nothing okay and time for the lottery still no luck in the lottery <laughs> One day, one day my time will come. Okay, and 20 tickets have been acquired. All right, let's see what we do today. On test your strength, we are useless and we got 35 Neo points. Okay, better than nothing. And time for coconut shy. Let's see how we do today. Also had some coconut luck yesterday. Got another coconut, so that felt great. So the coconut gods have, have smiled upon me once again. <laughs> I am the coconut queen. <laughs> All right, we have capped out, started with 39.5, ended with 39.3, so only a little bit of a loss today, not bad. And it's time for the Labre. Let's see what happens to Tiflo today. And gains two strengths. Okay, thanks for that, I guess. Let's check in with Pepet Labre. We got Deer Gibbles over here doing nothing. Let's see. And now he's Katoni Wannabe. <laughs> okay, I'll take that. That's a fitting name for his little smirk. <laughs> And time for a losing. Ugh, we are in level 33, getting into danger territory. Usul native jacket. Okay, interesting uh, item choice. Only 11k for that. We can do that. We can do that. No problem. And yeah, I have it. Woohoo! And let's go check in with the coincidence. Still on the same shit. Still. What the F? And I've been like canceling these out and everything. Uh, one, I got some nice soul out here to sell these for 27. Next one jumps up to 35. This guy's profiteering out here. All right. But we're not going to play. Sorry, not sorry. Okay, and let's go check in with trivia. As of April 1st, 2024, which is the only pet that cannot be painted gray, and according to the Daily Neopets, that is the Vandegire. That is the newest Neopet species out there. We got 506 Neo points and a gray Tuscanini plushie. Awesome. Let's go check in with the news. Uh, as of April 13th, they did mention the Puzzle Hunters Club. I think I, we talked a little bit about that on Thursday or Friday. I can't, I can't remember now, but they mentioned it themselves that no one has cracked the solution quite yet. The Open Pharmacy has some new items. We got a wheelchair and a bipedal wheelchair and see mall news. And finally, it's the weekend. Check out a new movie. Okay. Also, in other shopkeeper news, let's go. Let's go find him. All right, at the top of Terra Mountain, we have the super happy Icy Fun Snow Shop, and he has turned gray, and now it's the moderately content Icy Amusement Snow Shop. So the, the changing shopkeepers, changing everything, is starting to leach out into Terra Mountain. So I think we might see other little pockets of worlds start to get affected before we see a global just switch of all shopkeepers and, and shopkeeper accessories like the Negri <laughs> being turned gray. So interesting that we got this change. But yeah, I haven't seen anything else for for, for gray day so i think it, it is just getting that avatar getting that battle dome challenger if you haven't gotten those yet we'll see if anything else happens tomorrow with a gray day late news cycle but even then we might miss that since i do my video so early on on monday so keep, keep your eyes peeled there, there's some shenanigans afoot a lot of speculation and play people are hopeful there might be something extra this little gray day we just don't know but hopefully with Festival of Negs right around the corner, hopefully launching either this week or next week, perhaps. We'll, we'll get some more uh, plot tease in time, which will feel great. But from here, I'm going to clean some stuff up and then we will hop into the Battle Dome. Let's go to the Battle Dome, Battle Dome. Let's go to the Battle Dome. We'll fight our pets against the rest in the Battle Dome. Still been playing with the squishy brain puddle that is the giant space fungus, able to knock him out in two shots with our latest fairy ability, which has been really nice. I'm waiting till the next Hidden Tower discount day to, to, to buy up Varia, is, or no, the Ghost Kerchief Bomb. That's what I'm waiting for there. Starting off with just some money. So I'm gonna make quick work of this guy and we will see where we land.
All right, I know we've capped out on items. It's just not giving me the message. So let's go see what I got today. We got two tan coats dots today. And this we've never got the Space Fungus Cheese Cracker before. So eh, at least we got some code stones today, right? Before we go, did have a question that I caught about how do I keep track of my goals? So I kind of have a few places that I keep track of goals. Uh, my two main tools are just using the free Google Office tools like uh, Google Sheets and Google Docs. So I just have a little notepad when I first started that, okay, well, here's what we, we can talk about Jelly Neo's tools and, and wish list tools. So where I started, was, you know, if we go to the Jelly Nino items database, they have some checklist tools, some price checker tools. So I was trying to use their avatar hunter checklist, which avatar checklist tool. So you can, you know, copy and paste your source code into this tool, and then it'll also generate. So I got, I'll just go do this. So you just, what you have to open it and then right click view page source. Control A, Control Copy, and then you can paste this source code in, into their tool. We're gonna exclude retired avatars, exclude avatars difficult for new account. Well, uh, no. And then only show in a new avatar, perk avatar, I don't know. Show me avatars I need. <laughs> and so it, it gives you this whole list of, of all the avatars you still need to find. So I still need to find 123. And you can also get this pet page code. So originally when I tried to do this, I wanted to dump this code onto one of my pets pages. But at the time, I still needed the Let It Snow avatar. And it wouldn't let me put it on my pet page. Why couldn't I put it on my pet page, you might ask? It's because the phrase, let it snow, because when you put let it snow, like sloth.gif, it was let it snow.gif or whatever. Let it snow contains a bad word in it. <laughs> the word tit is in, in let it snow, so I couldn't save this fucking code to my pet page. So that's when I decided to kind of hop over and use this just docs.google setup. And I also keep some other information in here for myself. So if we look, um, I, my avatar hunting is, is all sorted in a way that you know makes sense to me. So I did manually just copy and paste everything from this avatar checklist output, deleted some of the stuff I didn't need to know and sorted it myself in just in a Microsoft Word or whatever word processor you have. And it did retain all the links to make that easy for me. Some other things that I keep is I got my NP goals. So I've been working on the seashell album i got two more to go and i just kind of keep track of some prices um i keep track of the these were i was originally looking for four and then i, I bought two of those um so i just still need these two stupid expensive ones more there is i am my other goal i'm working on is getting 100 unique neo deck cards i have surpassed that goal and i do actually use the item database wish list here so you can create wish lists but i treat them as like private checklists so i have one for tcg cards have one for books that I want to read to Adwin, and I have one for my Apple Gallery collection. So you can manage this pretty easy here. So if you wanted to, you know, make a, a Jelly Neo wish list like this for whatever you might be interested in, let's just say I want to get a, a gourmet foods list. So we do gourmet foods, we would have to go to the gourmet food tab, you would see what your pet that you're trying to feed has eaten. Again, you do that right click view page source, copy that, paste it in here. You can choose, you know, show images, show prices, show rarities if you want. You can sort by name. I usually like to sort by price. Um, you could sort this down by food type if you wanted, because that is something people do is just they only feed their pet like a certain type of gourmet food um, just for the aesthetic. Uh, because it is really hard to get on that that leaderboard table and then you generate the list and you can hit export you know either add to wish list or get a pet page code and then after you you know save and generate this I got a lot of gourmet food ain't never gonna do this one so you can either you know make a new wish list to add this to or whatever I don't want to track gourmet food like this so I'm not gonna do that but let's say I was managing my um, TCG deck we would just hit you know manage items you can search by whatever you, you might need. I don't know. See, I've already removed that one. I, I went on a shop, card shopping spree recently, so a lot of these I have. But um, the other thing you can do, so right now I think I have this sorted by rarity type, just to kind of group, because I was going to try to finish color sections after I got a good chunk done. But if you go to the manage settings, you can change how, how stuff is sorted and if it's 
public or private, whatever. I usually keep my stuff kind of private because it's, it's my tool, damn it. And I, <laughs> so those are just a few of the things that I, I monitor and track. Like I got my Battle Dome training. So just like uh, before I had premium, I was kind of working up to giant spectral mutant Wayland. But now that I have premium, I, I've been doing the bubbling space fungus guy, whatever his name is. Got some casual activities um, that I was trying to do. There's a really handy magma pool checklist tool on Jelly Neo that I was able to use to find my time, site trophies, my pet pages. I just keep track of random stuff in here. This is just kind of my, my brain dump. As far as on my spreadsheets, what do I keep track of? I was going through all the games just trying to see how well I think I could do at a game to go for a trophy. So th this is the way my brain works. Is in spreadsheets a lot of the time went through discerned if things were, were working or not what what the what type of, of thing it was so that's one of my tabs i kept track of all my fairy festival recycling in a spreadsheet i've been planning and working for fairy festival 2024 only assuming if it's going to work the same um, i just wanted to make sure i had the max amount of rarity items and i, I hit my goal so yay me <laughs> i'm done hoarding for that um and just some other miscellaneous things I track like um, I've been tracking the prices of the Halloween trick-or-treat bags because I still haven't sold those so I've just been kind of monitoring prices uh, historically to see when it might be a good time for me to sell got some video editing stuff in here that I'm not going to show you got some Apple gallery stuff that I'm, I'm working through use this for <laughs> my obelisk video and everything else I'm going to keep to myself but because it's just video editing and, and whatnot. But those are some of the things that I keep track of. I don't go crazy keeping track of like my kitchen quests every day or my food club win history. I just do not have the energy for that. If you do more power to you, that that's something that people track. If you want to track a game that score that you, you've been practicing and, and want to watch your progress on and just whatever data you're interested in, just start tracking it or just start keeping links. You can also have, you know, bookmarks. My bookmark is, is pretty sad uh, for Neo Pets, but that's another thing. But those are just some of the things I, I track and what some of my current goals are. Yeah, just because someone asked. So there, there you go. Well, that's This is where, where, where half of my brain lives when it comes to Neo Pets. So. All right, but that is where I'm going to call it for today, folks. I hope you're having fun out there. Happy Neo Petting. Hope your luck is way better than mine, and I will catch you next time. Bye. <laughs>